Hello friends and welcome back. In this lecture we will solve our second exercise on arrays. And this is the exercise. I want you to write a program that displays the sum and the product and the average of the elements of an integer array. So for example, suppose that we have this array over here, then our program should display that the sum is equal to 12, the product is minus 210, and the average is 2.4. So pause the video and try to do this. So let's go to IntelliJ. Okay, so suppose that we have this array over here and we want to get the sum and the product and the average. So first of all, let's define three variables. We will use the first one to store the sum and of course we will start from zero. And the second one will be for the product. And in this case, I will initialize it to be equal to one. You will see why in a little bit. And finally, we will have a variable for the average, all right? Now all we need to do is to iterate over the elements of the array and each time we will add the element to the variable sum and multiply it with the product. So let's iterate over this array. We will start from zero as long as i is less than the length of the array like this and i++. And inside we will add to the variable sum the element at the index i. And also we will multiply the product by the element and index i. So as you can see, this is why we started the product at 1. Because suppose that the product is equal to 0, then each time we are multiplying numbers sub i by 0. So the variable product will remain equal to 0. This is why we started at 1. So initially, the product will be equal to the first element, because it will be equal to 1 multiplied by the first element. And in the second iteration, it will be equal to itself multiplied by the second element. So now it is equal to the product of the first two elements. And after that, it will be multiplied by the third element. So it is now equal to the product of the first three elements. And this will continue until we reach the last element. And this is how we will get the product of the elements of our array. And the same thing will apply to the variable sum. And of course, we started the variable sum at zero because initially it should be zero. And each time we are adding the element and index i to this variable. So now you might be asking, what about the average? So as you may know, the average is equal to the sum divided by the numbers of the elements. So as you can see over here, we calculated the sum. And outside the loop, I will calculate the average. So over here, I will assign the average to be equal to the sum divided by the number of the elements, like this. Now as you can see, we are dividing an integer by an integer. So this is an integer division. So let's cast the variable sum to be a double in order to get a double answer. Now finally, all we need to do is to print the sum, the product, and the average. So let's print the sum is equal to concatenate the sum. After that, the product equals, and let's concatenate the product. And finally, we have the average, and let's concatenate the average. So let's run the program. And as you can see, this is our result. So this is it. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.